On April 21st, Moxie Salon of Pinckneyville, Illinois, was forced to close their doors indefinitely due to Illinois Governor J.B. Pritzker issuing a stay-at-home order for Illinois residents. The order says that all non-essential businesses should close to keep from spreading the coronavirus. Non-essential workers have the option of applying for unemployment or getting paid leave. Unfortunately, a lot of hairstylists and nail technicians are self-employed, so they wouldn't receive the benefits of unemployment and they have no one to pay them leave. So what are they doing? There are some people who are making house calls. Um, a couple even got, a, one got a little part-time job on the side, um, making a little extra money in the meantime. And um, some of us are just enjoying being home with our families, I guess, trying to. Kind of bored sometimes, but it works. To help out with the loss of income, the building owner waived the rent fee, and the business owner waived the station rent fee for each stylist. Other than income, salon workers have a lot more to lose. At Moxie Salon, they have had to build up their clientele from the ground, so they have the potential risk of losing everything they've worked for. Of course, customers get frustrated that they can't get their hair done. Amazingly enough, we think we're all essential, you know. They think getting their hair cut's essential. I think I'm essential because I make people feel good about themselves. To keep their skills fresh in their minds, these two hairdressers decided to take the risk and practice hairstyling on each other. Hopefully, this salon and other salons can get back to business soon.